When it comes to technological breakthroughs in robotics, you'd be hard-pressed to find anything nearly as innovative as the Tesla bot and Boston Dynamics Atlas. With its projected low asking price and high versatility, the Tesla bot promises us a key to a world that we could only dream of only a couple of years ago. But that world might not be as bright as we thought it is, and the idea of developing humanoid AI robots that are widely available to the masses hides some very ominous concerns. What if the Tesla bot proves to be hazardous to humanity? What future awaits us if that scenario takes place? Join us as we take a look at what's going to happen if the Tesla bot goes wrong. Humans have, throughout many centuries, attempted to create life. We've always been obsessed with the idea of playing God and creating completely new life forms or even granting life to inanimate objects, always to no avail. The best thing that humans could ever do was simply imitate life, and so they did, with puppets, marionettes, and above all else, robots. Robots present the absolute pinnacle of imitating life, and the first proper robot, which was constructed and designed by none other than Leonardo da Vinci, managed to show some levels of autonomy, which made it more human-like and made it look like it was alive. During the past century, robotics, artificial intelligence, and science in general developed rapidly, and the result of this can be seen in our day-to-day -day life with completely automated vacuum cleaners, self-driving cars, extremely complex AI programs, and many other things that are the result of our efforts to make life as comfortable and as efficient as it can be. The Tesla bot's function will be the same, as it'll do everyday chores that would otherwise take away time from its owners, time that they could use both recreationally and productively. It'll be designed to fulfill our requests and follow our orders without question. So in essence, the Tesla bot will be our own personal slave. Recent videos showing the prototype Tesla Optimus's functionality have shown us that it'll be capable of using different kinds of tools. It'll be able to pick up and carry heavy items, while also being able to move at a relatively steady pace without any major difficulties. The prototype robots also managed to assemble another prototype out of the parts that were scattered all across the table, which showed that the Optimus will have good movement coordination while also being very perceptive. The AI found in the Optimus is actually derived from the Advanced Driver Assistance System, or ADAS for short, and it's single-handedly responsible for Tesla's intuitive movements and extremely advanced spatial intelligence. Tesla officials announced that the robot will be 5 foot 7 tall and it'll weigh 125 pounds, which means that its physique will be similar to the average female. It'll also be able to pick up things that weigh up to 45 pounds. As impressive as it is, this sounds very worrisome. Even though the Optimus robot is weaker than an average human being, it could easily hurt a child or an infant, and further development of them can raise even more worrisome points, which leads us to the question, can the Tesla bot prove to be hazardous to humanity? Yes, very much so. What if one of these robots gets hacked into or its software gets corrupted? The Tesla bot will be connected to the internet, making it an easy target for remote hacking. They'll be a perfect tool for harming people without even coming close to them. Plus, the bots that were recently shown by Tesla are just the prototype versions of the Optimus. The production version will be much more agile and considerably stronger, and it'll also be much more perceptive compared to the prototypes. Now imagine if masses of these upgraded versions of the Tesla bot got hacked into by a, for example, terrorist organization. They'll have an army of sleeper bots that could potentially go off at any time. They could swarm humans, and with their ability to wield tools, a singular robot could easily overpower an unarmed human, let alone a whole pack of them. Think of what a pack of these Tesla bots that have gone corrupt and are armed with wrenches, axes, and other tools could do to a group of unarmed people. Even more horrifying is the fact that they're programmable, and they can theoretically be taught to use even more lethal weapons, like, for example, firearms. Plus, let's also remember that other companies are also developing their own general-purpose robots, the most prominent of which is Boston Dynamics. Their most popular humanoid robot is the Atlas, and it's currently by far one of the most advanced ones on the entire market, as it can do basic parkour, run extremely fast, and it's made to be pretty tough and rugged. Basically, you're not getting away from it if it sets its sights on you. 
On the other side, what if the Tesla bot gets adapted for military purposes? We'll have entire squads or battalions of robots that will be fully optimized and tweaked to do their one and only job, which is to harm other robots or individuals without feeling any pain, remorse, or conscience. Worst of all, what guarantees that those robots and the AI that controls them won't become self-conscious? What if humans actually succeed in creating life after millenniums of trying to do so? And what if our biggest creation becomes the singular reason behind our ultimate demise? What kind of a future awaits us then? If the Tesla bot or any other humanoid bot that gets mass produced goes wrong, we'll be met with a very grim future. Many movies predicted the rise of self-conscious robots and AI, and some showed it on a lower, individual scale, like Blade Runner for example, as the artificial human beings known simply as replicants have been developed to the point that they're indistinguishable from real humans. The movie shows us that treating robots as slaves, exploiting them, and treating them as tools without compassion could force them to turn against us, even though they weren't designed to do so initially. The problems of developing robots are not limited to hypothetical dystopian societies that are on the verge of extinction, as simple over-reliance on robots can have devastating effects on humanity, and the majority of those problems arise from replacing humans with robots. A society that's completely dependent on robots, a society that marginalizes and excludes humans that used to occupy all kinds of jobs and lets them starve, and a society that sacrifices human lives for profit is a society that's deemed to eventually fail. What do you think? Is the world going to prosper from the Tesla bot and many upcoming mass-produced robots similar to it? Or are we at the dawn of humanity with our creation as our executor? Be sure to let us know in the comment section down below. Also, while you're there, be sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel as only 3% of you are subscribed. Another piece of media that tackles this problem is a game called Detroit Become Human and it manages to put us, the players, in the shoes of repressed androids that seem to have gone haywire, while also showing us the perspective of others that are still normal. This game is more of a story-driven, interactive movie, and it allows the player to choose their own path and allows them to shape a world that both shuns and accepts robots and androids as a new life form. There are, however, numerous benefits to developing robots, and they're not limited to simply doing daily chores instead of humans. Robots can actually replace humans in high-risk, low-reward jobs, such as construction jobs at a great height, mining jobs, or working with highly toxic materials, gases, and liquids. Developing robots and AI is definitely one of the most polarizing and conflicting questions that humanity ever came across, as they're both extremely alluring points to developing them. But there are also some that leave us wondering if the world is going to see another century, if it keeps going at the pace that it's taking right now. Honestly, we're not even sure what to think of when it comes to AI and robot development. Only time will tell if humans finally succeeded in creating life, or if our efforts will be the catalyst for our own undoing. There is a movie that perfectly encapsulates both the pros and cons of developing and using robots on a daily basis. What's even more impressive is the fact that it managed to predict the Tesla bot, its role in society, and its general appearance almost 20 years ago. If you'd like to know more about it, be sure to check out this video.